I know it's Tuesday. However, I am a mom with children during a pandemic and sometimes they inhibit my ability to get things done on time. So after cleaning up all the Nerf guns, we got started. We're gonna start. We are making snowman. Yeah! Good job, DJ. We are making DIY snowy puppy paint. It is so easy, so fun, ridiculously inexpensive. The kids have a blast. Shaving cream. Glue. School glue and shaving cream. Equal parts. And shaving cream. And get it. And get it. And a ball. Ball. And paint. 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 So in case you didn't get that, there is zero science to this. It is super easy. All you have to do is mix equal parts of shaving cream and glue. Now, when you're looking for your shaving cream, you wanna find a shaving cream that is the foamy shaving cream that is preferably unscented because the ones that are very scented will make your kids smell like shaving cream for basically a week. Oh, I And what are those? Just sticks, mm -hmm. sticks. You just press this like a button, ready? Oh, God. <laughs> Okay, JJ, go. Mom, these fools. Yep, the whole cup. Press it. Woo! Get in there. So use your spatula. Oh. Use your spatula. Oh, no, I wouldn't do it. So what do you do? Scoop it into the bowl. Ready? Oh, wait, no, like into the top? Yep. <laughs> go, JJ, go. Good, good. Let the kids mix with the spatula until it's all really well combined. Mix, mix, mix. Keep mixing, JJ. Mix, so mix. So I just grabbed some cardstock that was a blue color to create the background so you could really see the white puppy paint to create our snowmen. And then we added on a couple sticks, added in some googly eyes. Oh, look. Mine is super yellow. Hi, ah, you people. Ah. <laughs> and I just used some paper and some foam sheets to create any kind of detail like the little carrot nose or the little buttons, anything like that. And then you can make it really fun by adding in some paint. I recommend using a non-toxic paint. I love Crayola, I swear by them. And you can add in any colors you like. Now to make it sort of like that classic puppy paint feel, you can get these little plastic squeeze bottles and just pour your mixture into those and you can squeeze them onto the paper. We created some snowflakes and added on a bunch of glitter. Okay, okay, well, it does make a mess, but that is why it's called Making Messes Monday. Yay! One of my favorite tips for mess success is to cover your table with a food grade butcher paper. That is so cool! I love the food grade butcher paper because if the kids are at the table snacking and doing things before you get started on your crafting, then you just don't have to worry about it. It's food grade. And then of course, I love to give them creative freedom. So JJ just put lots of eyeballs on his by the end of it. This was so much fun. It kept them busy forever. Listen, we don't get snow here in California. I am missing snow. So we created our very own little snow day. If you are having a snow day where you're at with actual snow and are trying to keep your kids entertained, this is a great one. If you live somewhere that doesn't have snow like I do, you get a little bit of that, that snowy wintry feel by doing the little snowmen and the snowflakes. And it's super fun because when it all dries, it feels really foamy. I cannot recommend this one enough. All of the information for this DIY will be on FromScratchWithMaria.com. Bye.